Wow, guys, thank you so much. I should not be surprised, though, because I am at Fairfield as a volunteer, and I sit on the school board of HCCS, Heritage Community Christian School, where my sons attend, and I, I don't want to get choked up, but I'm telling you, this community is beautiful. Um, things haven't been so easy in the last couple of years for people as the rising prices of groceries and gas and everything, and we decided that since people bless our store with your beautiful donations that we hand select and only put out the best stuff, that we wouldn't be fast to rise our prices along the same way that other fair stores were doing. And so we're, we are a full nonprofit. You still don't have to pay tax when you shop with us. We keep our prices low. We give you a bag. We will help you to your car. We are grateful for your donations. We will pray with our customers. We will listen. We will make a coffee in the back and bring it to you if you need. And that is community. So although the big picture of thrifties is that Without thrifties, our school, Heritage Community Christian School, would probably not be open. It's helping to pay our teachers' salaries. It's helping to keep the tuition down for our kids to make it a reasonable place for private education. And it's a way that we can reach the community. It's a ministry without maybe reaching people who would never walk into church. And so it's so special for us to be able to spread the love that we receive from the community out to others, and our two staff members, Grace and Bethany, we can't thank them enough for the hard work that they do, but there are volunteers, grandparents, um, regular customers who just love the vibe at Thrifties and want to come and volunteer there to hang out with us. We're having fun, we're getting things done, and we're making a difference.